Plus, those drugs that I'm talking about that do such a good job in opioid sparing also made Michael's intubation yesterday go so smoothly. Even though we had to putter around in his nose, which is not a, most people don't want stuff or people in their nose. Yeah. But I had a bronchoscope in his nose, I had a breathing tube in his nose, I was wandering around looking in his back of his throat and chatting, you know, so I look over here and look over there. And he, all that went smoothly because of using the NMDA, the, our ketamine and our alpha-2, our Presidex drugs. I was excited in the paperwork that we had to review that was mentioned and I thought, wow, that sounds like an answer to prayer. Not only that, there's one other wild and interesting and positive side effect. Another problem that's not related, but is interesting to you, is doctors in the ER sometimes see people. Doctors in the ER imagine have to deal with a problem that I want to tell you about. Let's suppose you're an ER doctor. And they say, go see Mr. Smith in room four. So you go over to room four, and there's a patient in there, and he's sad, and he's crying, he tried to commit suicide, he's super depressed. So what you'd like to do is help that patient by giving them an antidepressant. But you might know that Prozac, when you give it to somebody, takes two weeks, right? So they've done research trying to find a drug that would rapidly treat depression. And these wacky researchers, they decided to use one of the drugs we use called ketamine. So they started an IV. They asked him before the start of the infusion, they said, are you depressed? They go, yeah, I just tried to kill myself, you goofball. So okay, good, and they write that down. They started an intravenous drip of ketamine. And they repeat the question, are you depressed, every five minutes. And by 20 minutes, the depression lifted. And it stayed away when they measured by repeating the questions for 10 days. Wow. Pardon me? Wow. Yeah. <laughs> so the ketamine dose that you get is also intriguing because in the post-operative period, you can be a little down, you can be a little grumpy, you can be things like that. And one of the nice, interesting, positive side effects of ketamine is, I'm a little happier. That's okay. That's Are nothing you wrong. starting <laughs> coffee at huh? home? <laughs> Actually, ketamine now has become a drug of abuse. So that, really? you know, now, uh, I don't know, are you kids out there don't use drugs? Um, <laughs> but now, you know, kids have recognized this, yeah. and it's actually, it's also used in horses as an anesthetic, so it means it's kind of easier to get to. And so now there's, there's some street use of this happening, so. She has 20 horses at home, so. I'm oh, do you really? I was thinking about doctoring up my <laughs> cohabitation partners. <laughs> yeah. Well, I'm, I know so you might want to talk to Heath Ledger about how that worked out for him. Yeah. Oh, I just decided to add some drugs this morning. And I'm very happy, but I'm getting sleepy. Yeah. So, yeah, it, it's, it's, but in controlled circumstances, it's unbelievable. I mean, in other words, we're getting some real positives. And again, look at Sabrina. Look at our guys. I mean, they look terrific. And so, um, uh, Ms. Nelson, what do you think? Oh, yeah. Good. Yeah, we commented. You, you had had a great question yesterday about the pain medicine, and I think we feel real good. He's, he's done well. Um, other questions from the folks who had surgery yesterday? Yeah. When you were doing all this stuff in my nose, was that more where my eyes open? Uh, you, you kind of uh, occasionally took a swipe at me. Good. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be hard to do with my arm. You brought the whole arm board up at me. All right, just want to make sure. <laughs> Did I hit you with this side or the back side? <laughs> I got, you, 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 kinda, you had like this arm was coming. I was on this side over here. Yep, and right. so a couple of times you are like. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't, it wasn't a fair fight because you were under a lot of medicine. So no, I just wait a second. And we have, we have yeah. the other thing we put on your brain here is a combined electroencephalogram. <clears throat> Have you seen the EEGs where they stick all those wires? We don't do the whole thing. We just do it three little spots, and they do a combined EEG, and so then we can dial in your medicine perfectly. And so we did that for you. We dialed down your medicine so that you were uh, hopefully not remembering that I was wandering around in your nose with 15 Q-tips. <laughs> but every once in a while, the drug level would drift up a bit, and you'd take a little gentle swing at me, and I'd say, well, maybe we'd give him a little bit more. Because <laughs> I don't think I would have been able to stand up against you if you were wide awake. <laughs>
So, but it, it all went so smoothly and so beautiful that I, I used to be an ICU attending and uh, putting in a breathing tube in that situation can be a really a scary experience because uh, quick, quick, you know, oxygen going down, quick, we gotta do, so there's a lot of noise and things like that. And um, it turns out in your case though, it was just, you're, you were constantly able to breathe, your oxygen was perfect the whole time, and so we could be, all, we could all be very relaxed in that situation. And again, it goes back to the use of these newer drugs. <clears throat> they don't take away your, your drive to breathe, so you were protected, you were safe that whole time, and we could just putter around in your nose until we had found the spot to put the breathing tube in. I noticed in the manual it said uh, six days before driving. Is that still? Driving is two weeks. Two weeks? Yeah, and the reason for that is not that you can't drive. I drive. <laughs> <laughs> you can drive, but what we're worried about is if you suddenly have to push up on the clutch and turn to get out of the way of a drunk driver or a three year old who comes in front of you, that little twinge that you've got might interfere with emergency maneuvers. Okay. So you can lift weights, you can do the lawn, you can mow the lawn, you can. Uh, wash dishes, do laundry, make the bed, all those things are fine because if you get a little twinge, making the bed is not going to be, but driving a thing, if you were piloting a jet airplane, eh, probably not. <clears throat> so we don't recommend you drive, get somebody to drive you for the first couple of weeks until you feel back to normal. Okay. And I still have these patches on today. Right, those patches are part of the NMDA and the Alpha 2 blockers that control your pain. So you can take them off because they can cause dry mouth and blurred vision, but they're also helping you uh, avoid some of the post-op pain. So I'd, I'd leave them on. Yeah, I've experienced both of those. Yeah, and if that really bothers you, peel them off. No, I didn't. <coughs> I wondered when I was supposed to take them off. Uh, um, other questions from our folks from yesterday? Any questions from the people from today, of the people from yesterday, because we're going to let them go back upstairs in a minute. Okay, you guys look great. Can I say something? Please. <clears throat> All the ones that are going in today, I kept asking my husband last night, 1 to 10, where's your pain, where's your pain? At the highest, it was 2.5. So, wow. just know. Really? Yeah. yeah. And I have to say this, you all have added some medicines to your regimen since 11 months ago. I know. And I think it has made it even, it's even better. better. So, you're <coughs> wonderful, wonderful hands. And we talked about this yesterday. We took the staples out of, of the previous patients. There was nobody that was bruised. And when Whitney had her, she had a little bruising. And most everybody had a little bruising, but nothing compared to what we saw yesterday. So, unless we're practicing. <laughs> All right. Um, Sandy, can you escort everybody back upstairs? Right, sure. 